New today, the FBI has released previously classified details about its investigation into 9-11. On President Joe Biden's order, the first release shows investigators believe Saudi Arabia's government was involved in helping some of the attackers. Brianna Keelar has more. The FBI releasing a newly declassified document with more information about the September 11th terrorist attacks. It's the first of several expected to be released since President Joe Biden ordered a declassification review of the investigation earlier this month. The heavily redacted report from 2016 details the FBI's probe into suspected Saudi government support for the 9-11 hijackers. This includes whether a Saudi consular official and a suspected Saudi intelligence agent provided logistical support to at least two of the men who hijacked planes on 9-11. According to the document, the FBI interviewed an employee of the Saudi consulate in Los Angeles in 2015. The person, whose name was redacted, said he was in contact with Saudi nationals, suspected of providing support to the first two 9-11 hijackers to arrive in the United States. The Saudi government has denied any government involvement in the attacks. The FBI released the 16-page document on the 20th anniversary of the September 11th attacks. Just hours after Biden attended memorial services in New York City, Pennsylvania, and at the Pentagon. These memorials are really important, but they're also incredibly difficult for the people who are affected by them. On September 3rd, the president signed an executive order directing the Justice Department and other federal agencies to release declassified documents over the next six months. This move fulfilling one of Biden's campaign promises, and it comes after pressure and scrutiny from some families of 9-11 victims, some even telling the president he would not be welcome at any memorial events unless the documents were declassified. Before the release, former Defense Secretary Leon Panetta said he was pleased with Biden's decision to order the declassification review, but he's doubtful it will provide the closure that many families are looking for. I think that uh, the families of the victims are entitled to know the whole truth of what was uh, involved and who was involved uh, when it came to 9-11. Uh, I suspect that uh, they're not going to get the kind of satisfactory answers about the role of Saudi Arabia uh, with regards to this attack. Brianna Keelar reporting the Saudi embassy in Washington issued a statement last week supporting the document release. It says the country has nothing to hide and called for transparency on the issue.